What is up, YouTube? We've been waiting a long time for this. Two weeks. And we're here. Chapter 1044, 1044. Oh my God, I am excited to read this. I'm so excited I went looking through all the websites to try and find this because the website I'm at, for some reason, they don't have it. Anyway, let's get to it. Oh my goodness. One Piece 1044. Joy Boy, what, what was happening there? I mean, Luffy kind of re-waking up with Joy Boy. What the hell was that? Anyway, feel free to read along with me and enjoy. Hope you enjoy my crappy voice acting. Here we go. One Piece. Chapter 1044. Warrior of Liberation. I wonder what's going on there. Okay, so we have German 66 Cold-Blooded Voyage, Volume 8. Mama's out at sea. Let's start our research. What are they about to do? Oh, no, they're not going to cut him up, are they? Oh, no. Oh, man. That's not going too well for them. Anyone going to come and save them? I mean, eek. That's not... <laughs> that doesn't look too good. Okay, how do you navigate this chapter? This this page, this website is not designed so well. All right. <clears throat> so you got Zunisha right here, who I don't know why, how Momonosuke wanted to surrender when you have Zunisha right here that could just slap everybody in Wano if you wanted to. A resounding pulse. What's happening? How can I still stand? Huh? Is that Luffy? Where the Joy Boy would... What's happening? How can I still stand? I just lost. But I feel like I'm having a blast. <laughs> so it's... Luffy... Luffy is... Joy Boy? Sunisa said that? So now Yamato's like, what? Next page, page three. Pleasure Hall. Right Brain Tower. Right Brain Tower. Gah! Kya! Sir Pirate, you're awake! So Sanji will come. Luffy? So Sanji can sense it. This is like Dragon Ball Z now. Everybody can sense power levels. They're like, I can sense it. I guess it's observation hockey. What the heck is that going, going on? Live floor. So everybody's noticing it. What the heck is... I guess it's power... Whatever. Let's just go with it. Live floor. What the... Huh? Is... Is that Sir Straw Hat? Maybe I should do that voice. Is that Sir Straw Hat? Straw Hat? Uh-oh. So everybody's noticing. Hey, you two. He's still breathing. Luffy's still alive. You gotta be okay, right, big bro? Oh, man. I'm just gonna relish in these pages because, oh, man. It's gonna be another week until the next one. If there's no break. Hopefully not. Here we go. Is this a two-page spread? What's going on? The Holy Land, Mary Joas. We sacrificed one of our best agents and enraged Kaido. Oh wait, the Hall of Power, Pangea Castle. Are we sure our priorities are straight? This is way better than the alternative. It's imperative that we snuff out something this problematic. No matter the era, the world the government has always failed. To acquire the Gomu Gomu fruit. Dang. Even after 800 years of trying. Dang. Really? 800 years? How did you fail for 800 years? What the heck happened? It's almost as if the fruit itself is invading us. Well, that's not impossible. All fruits... All zone fruits have a will of their own. 
and this one carries the name of a god. Hey, huh? after all, the Gomu Gomu fruit is really a mythical zone. It's the human human fruit. So the rumors are true. Human human fruit. Model Nika or Nika. <laughs> its user's body gains the properties of rubber in combat. They're supposedly only limited by their imagination. Putting smiles on faces far and wide, they are the embodiment of the warrior of liberation. So it's supposedly only limited by their imagination, the rubber in combat. So it's so it's rubber, human human fruit, but it's Nika. And they can stretch to rubber and I guess to whatever they want to do. I mean I guess in the case of Luffy, he wanted to turn into I mean, he, he could turn into that big thing and the snake man thing and all that stuff. Sun God Nika. Awakening exponentially strengthens their rubbery body and they have even more freedom. Whoa-oh, and look at that. Luffy's jumping, but that's not the sun. Is that the sun or is that the moon? That's the moon. It is allegedly... Allegedly... What? The most ridiculous power in the world! Some lightning strikes with black lightning. Are we going to get to see it this chapter? Let's find out. Treasure repository, second floor. Hi Hiyori! Oh, that's it. Hiyori! I really admire Odin. Think about what you're doing! <laughs> It was Hokkaido! He was using me! We could still run away together! Just remove these nails and... You spat in the face of a samurai you owe. Who would still believe you? My father kept his promise. Did he not? Uh oh. What nail though? I don't see the nail. I'm, I'm gonna have to look back later and see where did he get hit with the nail like when, when did that happen Eek. alrighty page six he danced like a fool for five long years because he thought you and Kaido would honor the secret agreement you made and free Wano he never even told his own family my father was a man who kept his word. He still expected the same of you when you agreed to let them go. If he withstood being boiled for an entire hour, even while his body was being burned by the oil. Despite it all, he always smiled. Always. I can't even fathom my father's suffering. He had to shoulder the burden by himself because the entire nation was your hostage. What's the matter, Hiyori? Oh, she's shaking. She's crying. Oh, man. What's going on? Oh, it's a flashback. What's the matter, Hiyori? Father, are you really okay with what everyone says about you? Of course I am. You know why? Because I have you guys. Really? And I swear I'll always be here for you. Oh yes, I've always said Odin was a great samurai. And so good, I can ensure his legacy is recognized. Your, your father- Clatter, she threw off the mask. Hold your tongue, you miserable wretch! I am Kozuki Hiyori! Oop, vengeance. She finally gets... Catharsis or vengeance? She, she finally gets her moment. 
So what is she going to do? I mean, she's there, kind of like just not helping him. So what is she doing? Eek! I was always proud to carry my father's name, even when I was starving and covered in rags. You, on the other hand, never had a trace of honor. Every day you were shogun was one too many. And as each day passed, more and more lives were lost. Oh, wait, stop! The don't do something you're going to regret. Seeking revenge is a day that I took theology, you know. Besides, killing me makes no difference. Kaido will still be unbeatable. Oh, Huh? I have failed. Is, is that you, Kanjuro? This is as far as I go. Your timing is impeccable! This is the ideal stage for your real final performance! Burn that woman to ash! Go on! Take her! Go for The failed revenge of a shoot 20 years in the making! This is the perfect title for your this tragic comedy! Take a look! Hiyori, a Kazuki survivor, should know that fortune favors the mighty! <laughs> you got quickie turns on the dime. That's the wrong way! I hope you went on fire. What the heck? The dawn will come! Conjurer, you idiot! Save me! It burns! The Kozuki clan always keeps its promises. Hmm, like a Lannister always pays his debt. Uh oh. I feel like anything's possible now. I can fight a little. I can keep fighting a bit longer. My heartbeat sounds funny. Da -dum, da -dum, dum -dum. This is my peak. This is gear fifth. So this is his peak. Dang, okay, so he's just yelling and doing a dance and everything. Interesting. He's just like. S explaining it all that's weird it's like those superhero comics from back then where they like had like all those panels with a million word bubbles <laughs> so kaido was like huh? what? oh wow hey you guys Whoops, super duper conqueror's hockey, huh? And Kaido's like, <laughs> Kaido's face. What the hell is that? It's on the roof? <laughs> hey, hey, what's happening, conqueror's hockey? Where's it coming from? Whoa. <laughs> Now Luffy, a giant hand just comes and What? Crab. Smash. What the heck? Luffy just came. Yoink. Just came out of the door and just... And meanwhile, a whole bunch of people just... Hmm? Hmm? I was like, eh? S straw hat? Luffy! And Luffy's like, hee 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 hee. Yoink? Really? The word is yoink? <laughs> it's like a comedy now. They make Kaido a little comedic. Whoops! <laughs> Luffy, literally, his hand is big enough to literally just grab Kaido. Kaido's a free giant ass dragon. He just, whoops. Yoink, get over here. Kaido san! Kaido's like, whoops! Kaido just got brought. He's like, what the hell? Oh my god. 12. What the heck? Take this! 
What things of Luffy turn into? Wait, take this. She, 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 she. Oh! So now he's throwing Kaido around. He's spinning Kaido around. Did anybody else ever do that to Kaido? I'm trying to think. Did Kaido get spun, spun around? Someone got spun around, but... <clears throat> was it like that? <laughs> so we just smack him around. <laughs> wow, like a cartoon. <laughs> Crash. <laughs> No, Kaido. Straw Hat! So you're still alive! I'm grateful. Kaido's like, yay, I get to fight again. Blast Breath! Whoops. He shot the Blast Breath. Luffy. <laughs> what the heck? Do you, you turn around? He looks up. Whoa! What the hell is up with Luffy? What the F? And he picks up the floor. What the heck? Go! Wait, so, so, wait, did he just yoink? And now you're just hearing the sound like yoink? What the heck? Okay, the real sound says guru. Yoink? See, is he stretching the floor now? Boing! He, he really? Boing! Really? <laughs> Boing! So the thing blew up. So Kaido got hit by his own thing. <laughs> mm -hmm. Kaido says, Sorry about that idiot from before. I didn't want to win like that. Don't sweat it. Now let's finish this. One Piece, Chapter 1044. The End. But, oh wait, the battle reaches its finale. Next issue, cover and color spread. So they're going to color Luffy. We're probably going to see him in color. Wow. Wow. So this whole Sun God Nika thing that they were talking about. Here it is. Here it is. Um, who's who was talking about it? He was mentioning the whole Sun God Nika thing. And here it is. Luffy, Sun God Nika. And he's like a cartoon. So, so he turns into a cartoon character. That's crazy. So he's like the mask. He's like Jim Carrey. In the mask where he like starts doing all this cartoony stuff. This is insane. Well then, I don't know what else to say. This is this is a crazy chapter. Meanwhile, as this, this as this is happening, you got Zunisha just standing by. Like, what's Zunisha gonna do? You got the whole like Marines like standing by as well. You got Big Mom's crew standing by. I mean, Zunisha could just be like. And just smack him all the way because Zunisha's huge. This is insane. It's like, what, what's Zunisha gonna do? So now that's what I'm wondering. And the environment, too. Like, is, is it gonna be like Luffy's just gonna like do some cartoony thing and throw away the entire island and keep it from crashing? I don't know. This is so strange now. This is really strange. And Luffy has like that, like hair i don't even know what color it's gonna be you can't even guess what color luffy turns into because all this color stuff is so weird with one piece you know how it is anyway wow what a chapter i mean luffy looks happy right luffy's happy and i'm making the scary faces to scare you haha <laughs> whatever okay anyway Thanks for joining me. I hope you enjoyed this chapter. And until the next one. Oh man, I'm going to have to be looking up a lot of stuff. Wow. And please like, comment, and subscribe. And I'll see you next time. 
random thing I just noticed. Did I foreshadow Luffy's appearance kind of two week like a few weeks ago with 1042? Because I randomly decided to draw Luffy, like Super Saiyan Luffy, as my cover for that time. And look at the way he looks now. Wow. Holy crap!